Zale and the others protested in vain as they were taken to the dungeon beneath the castle. There, they found that Lowell and Siren had already been imprisoned. I see. So our little friend turned out to be the Count's niece. But Zale saved that girl's life. I'm pretty sure that kind of thing shouldn't land you in the slammer. It's that damn Jural. No doubt he's been filling the Count's head with ideas. I'll wager we're infamous throughout the castle by now. That's one way to make a name for ourselves. I got you all into this. I'm sorry. Ah, it ain't your fault. If it comes down to it, we can bust out. Oi, there'll be no busting out. It's not like the Count believes everything Jarrell tells him. But he won't ignore an accusation from his future nephew either. Which is why we have to be patient. Someone called Dagron here. The Count wants a word. What did I tell you? I'll see what I can do. Just sit tight. Callista helped us so much. I promised I'd rescue her. Now look at me. There's nothing I can do. Damn it! Hey everybody, Orpheolus here. Welcome back to more The Last Story. In the last episode, we did some things. And, after that save, we're gonna go around talking to these prisoners because we're trapped. A lot's changed here since the current count arrived. If anyone says a bad word against him, bang, you end up here. Uh, I miss the days of the old Count. Are you Zale? You're gonna be questioned, get out. Hurry up! What's that sound? Ah, this is where we lock up the monsters we capture. Sometimes, we feed some unruly prisoners to them. <laughs> A harsh interrogation awaited Zay. He was charged with taking advantage of the Gurak assault to kidnap Callista and allowing the Gurak to sneak into the castle. My Lord Inquisitor, I witnessed this man and Lady Callista having a little conversation away from the ball. You seem to be on quite familiar terms with the lady. Tell me, was that the first time you liaised with her? That's... <laughs> I thought not. You've been trying to get close to her for some time, fueled by some unsavory motive, no doubt. You're wrong! I wouldn't... The accused will refrain from speaking out of turn. He will respond only when asked a direct question. This man was ordered to take Lady Callista somewhere safe. By General Astar. At that time, there was no one he could entrust with the task, except for that man. Hmm. But you did not see the two of them after that, correct? I know what I saw. I saw this man trying to whisk Lady Callista away. 
against her will, naturally. That's a lie, and you know it. You ran off as soon as the attack started. You dare to sully my noble name. Commoner, noble. All I see is a coward. The accused will mind his tongue. And your misdeeds certainly did not end there. You claim to have sneaked aboard a Garak warship and taken it over. If so, then why did you not simply escort Lady Callista back right away? What reason could there possibly have been to put the Fair Maiden in any further danger? That's because... Lord Giral is correct, young man. Have you anything to say? You managed to rescue everyone else. I put it to you that the only reason was that you wanted to kidnap her. No, you're wrong. You're going to have to do better than that. You won't defend yourself? My Lord Inquisitor, I believe we are wasting our time trying to get the truth from this commoner. Perhaps we should proceed in a manner befitting his status. Indeed. If he will not answer, then there is only one course of action. <laughs> oh, this is delicious. It seems the commoner has had enough. Nothing more we can do now. Let us adjourn. Take him to his cell. Your stubbornness merely prolongs your agony. You should know your station. Damn. Nothing for it. Come on, then. I told you, you can't handle that sword yet. I'm fine. I can do this. Well, be strong. Ah, looks like he's awake. Those rotten bastards, they really messed you up. I've healed you as best I can, but don't overdo it. Okay, now we're back in the slammer again. I haven't talked to everybody yet. What do you oh, have to say? No, I was meant to be on a date with that noble girl. Crap. Ah, uh, Lola. What was his name again? Just us in here before we knew what was going on. So yeah. Trapped in the dark with no way out. The story of my life. Uh, sorry, Yurik. So, is there anything else we could do? Uh, hey, look. Finally an appraisal. So, the question is, why do you have... Why do you have weapons in, the, in here? Why do I... Why can I buy weapons from you? I can buy weapons, I can buy armor. Jeez. With weapons like a knife or something, I could probably, like, break out of jail. I a, there must be some right good treasure there, I thought. So I snuck in. Of course, they found me in no time. Hmm. Just what have they got hidden down there? So it looks like there's some treasure. What do you have to say, sir? He's been telling everyone how he slaughtered a hundred Garak. But it's all lies. He stood at the back whimpering while we did all the fighting. He'd rather that wasn't none. So he had me thrown in here. Not a decent bone in his body. Yeah, it looks like that Jarrell isn't is us. So what do you have to we say? We didn't do anything wrong. We can't yield to these baseless accusations. All right, so that appears to be everybody. Um, wait, there's this guy in the corner we haven't talked to. Yeah, let's go talk to him. I have some. Huh. Haven't we? Never mind. What are you in here for? Well, uh, they caught me sneaking into a nobleman's mansion. Oh, a burglar. 
No, I am not a burglar. But my most precious treasure was taken from me. I couldn't stand idly by. I tried to deal with it lawfully, but my social status is a trifle low. They wouldn't deal with someone of my standing. I see. Sounds like we're in the same boat. You fellows too? You certainly don't seem like bad people. Maybe you could help me with something. Such as? Oh, um, uh, better to show you when the guard is gone. It seems like the guard has gone. So what is it? Take a look at this. I've been digging a hole. I'm an archaeologist, so I know about geology and old buildings. I thought there was something odd about this wall, and I wasn't disappointed. <laughs> we can get out of here. Well... Monsters live in there, so I couldn't do much good on my own. But you look like you can take care of yourselves. So, care to help? Oh, happy day! I knew you would. Let's go down there right away. I'll stay behind. Go once the guards disappeared. See you later. <laughs> 